Yo, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. Welcome, all my NBA on net fans out there. What's up with y'all, man? I know y'all been having beef with me crazy, asking me, hey, yo, where the videos at? What's up with you? Are you feeling good? Are you sick? What's going on? Where are my videos, bro? So here goes a video especially for you guys. I'm here to talk to you guys about the 4.2.4 update. I'm here to show you guys new cards. I'm here to show you guys new legendary matches. I'm here to show you guys everything that you need to know about this update as well as the all-star weekend integration that they have that's going to be lasting up until the 18th so i think you guys have maybe like one more day and then after that they're probably going to switch up everything take away the all-star challenges and all that and then it'll probably be back to normal regular day-to-day -day stuff so let's check out the first thing the first thing that they got is something called all-star challenge now you can do this up to i think 20 times a day and the first three are free. You don't have to spend any diamonds on the first three and you can get something called tokens, which is something new for All-Star Weekend. And you could trade them for rubies, topaz, emeralds, all different kinds of things. So you definitely wanna do those. Now, me, this is my Rose Garden server, but they've changed the name. It's so funny, they've changed all the names to all the servers. Mine is now number one, Chicago. So that used to be the old Rose Garden server. This is the server that I started on for NBA All Net. I'm a high premium level. I spent a lot of money in this. Um, <laughs> for all the people that know how you spend money in like uh, 2K, my team and stuff like that, I've spent a lot of money in this. And it's a mobile app, so I've been going crazy in this joint. You guys can see premium level six. And um, I think I think I'm even at higher premium level today. I think I just spent like $100 the other day. It's crazy. But um, another thing you guys want to know is my day-to-day -day regiment of NBA All Net. For all my new servers, what I do is I use up all my energy and I purchase uh, more energy and stamina from diamonds in order to max out everything. So I don't have any energy or stamina left to purchase after I'm done with the new servers. So I can keep up with the people that's actually putting more money into it than I am that can purchase up to like 10 energies or 10 staminas per day, things like that. Now, uh, what I'm doing here is you guys will probably be like, well, why are you upgrading and uh ranking up a card that you're not even going to use i have to do this for my daily regiment so in order for me to get my diamond my topaz my emeralds and everything from the tasks menu i have to do this all right that's 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 what i have to do now i cannot show you guys any max evolution or uh max training because all of my cards that i have here are already maxed out but what i can show you guys is the whole new catalyst effect now for catalyst cards they are now evolution cards that means that you can ev like evolve a car with like say for instance you got russell westbrook you can't evolve him with a chris paul you can only evolve a russell westbrook with a russell westbrook so it makes things a lot harder to evolve cards so for the people that are already at max evolution like me we're happy because we don't have to spend more money. We don't have to do more challenges. We can just do what we do and just make all different kinds of different setups. Like uh, you can have like Kobe Bryant and Shaq or you can try Blake and CP3 and try those out. Try different things, new things because my next thing that I'm gonna be doing on the Chicago server is going for Mythic cards. So starting next month in March, I'm gonna devote more time and money into Mythic cards. And Mythic cards are basically all the red cards. Now, uh, there are different setups that you can have, like uh, you can still have Kobe and Shaq Mythic. You can have uh, Dwayne Wade, Carmelo, and LeBron Mythic. So that's probably gonna be the setup that I'm gonna be going with. Now uh, you guys see here that I am maxed out in my strategy points. You kind of max out very early in those. Now the fusion, oh man, the fusion is something that is brand new to this. Now the thing about fusion is in order to get like a mythic card, you have to fuse together a lot of high ranking uh, legendary cards. Now the funny thing is, I tried to mesh together a bunch of uh, regular epic cards and it was an epic fail. I tried to fuse together like five different purple cards and it didn't even get to the orange level. It didn't get to legendary level at all. Now what I'm doing here is I'm just uh, closing everything, accepting all notifications, getting my luck up, getting my stamina up. 
Now, what you guys will see is uh, league rewards here. I definitely be popping in the leagues. Uh, I definitely get rings at the end of each league. I'm, I'm nice in this joint, man. I'm at a level 65 maxed out doing my thing. The only thing that I have to worry about right now is my develop uh, potential points and my gear. Gear is very hard to upgrade because it takes a lot of coins. So what you will see here is I have the auto upgrade feature and I'm gonna use all of my cash that I have right now for coins and it's gonna upgrade plus twos, plus threes because of my premium level. Now I'm gonna let you guys know now, if you wanna spend money on NBA All Net, the premium level for auto upgrading and doing, uh, what are they, the, the road to glory matches, those are the best ways to have premium if you have premium that's probably the easiest thing because you don't have to play all of those matches out now what you guys will see here is i have a lot of gear i mean look at the gear guys like i have over 1000 pieces of gear now what i'm doing here is highlighting the new feature that they have brought back to NBA All Net. They, this wasn't, this isn't brand new. This is something that they brought back. I highly requested this when I was talking to the dev team. Um, it was an option to select all and sell all gear. Now what I'm doing here is I'm unchecking all legendary gear and all of my rings, including uh, legendary sneakers and um, epic sneakers and stuff like that because I'm probably gonna wanna use those later in the, uh, down the road. So, you know, I'm just gonna uncheck all those because I don't wanna give them up. Now, I'm able to sell all of these pieces. Now, look how much it is worth, guys. Look at how much it's worth. It's worth almost 2 million coins right there. 2 million coins for selling all this gear right in a wallet. Bang, boom, shaka, pow, pow. Doing what I do best, man. And right here is basically all the gear that I'm probably going to use later down the line. And even if I don't use it, that's fine because, you know, a lot of people probably like to save things just because you never know what type of matchups you might want to try out. Like you might want to try like a Kobe Bryant that's good at stealing or a Kobe Bryant that's good at interference and things of that nature. Also, what I'm doing here is I'm drafting a free card. Um, I'm going to draft Chris Bosh because I'm probably going to use him for my coaching. Please, guys, definitely go to the coaching thing and coach your players. If you don't coach your positions, you won't be good at NBA on that. You'll be trying to figure out why a level 45 guy is beating you when you're a level 52. So you definitely want to coach your players. Uh, the next thing I'm probably going to do is I'm going to go to Road to Glory. Yeah. Now, turning my efficiency on, that gets you double the prizes. So you definitely got to turn that on. Please do not be one of those people that don't turn it on and then you be mad at yourself because you needed maybe four or five more topaz to rank up a card and now you got to go out and buy it because you can't get anything from using your uh your nice little badges or anything like that now the highest level that i have gotten in any server is level 80 but what i'm going to be doing is changing my strategy i'm going to be changing my strategy to defensive because i've had an offensive strategy for a long time and i haven't like broken any barriers so um i'm gonna be changing that to defensive and you know uh give everybody like block jerseys give everybody steel jerseys give everybody uh what is it not ball control shirts but rebound shirts and everything like that and see how good i can become you know on rank matches uh playing up against my allies playing up against in these legendary matches against guys because i'm at a level 65 and i still haven't been able to get past uh What's his name? Steve Francis tier. Steve Francis tier is freaking stupid because I can't get past it. But I remember when I did change my uh, strategy on one other server, I was able to get past Steve Francis. So if they want you to get eight or nine blocks, change your freaking strategy to defensive. It only costs you 200, uh, I think 200 diamonds to change it. Change it, get your strategies popping, put on some block jerseys and then go in and play. And then you'll be able to win out. Now, uh, what I'm doing here is basically encouraging all of my allies to get my luck up. So when I do draft that free legendary card, it'll be something worth it. Also, when they have like uh, 1,500 uh, diamonds to draft five cards, if your luck is full, you can get two legendary cards. So if you need like a Blake Griffin and it's a Blake Griffin draw for 1,500 and, you, and that's the only legendary card there, guess what? You're gonna get two. So if you need two Catalyst Blakes, that's your option to go with. 
Now, what I'm doing here is uh, I'm going to go in and uh, just play a couple ranked matches real quick before I go to legendary matches because I want to show you guys the new legendary tiers. They've added, uh, I think it's about five or six of them, maybe seven, but I'm going to show you guys those at the end of the video because I know a lot of people aren't at these high levels and you want to see the people that you can go up against when you get uh, to the higher tiers. Now, uh, basically here... You guys see, man, these cards are no joke. I took the L by two points to this guy. I've lost two games. Look at that, man. 81 to 68. Whoever that dude is, he's a monster. He's a beast. <laughs> so I, I definitely don't want to go up against him again. But you guys see, man, I am in the top 50 for the ranked matches this week, man. Top 50. To say you're top 50 is a hell of an achievement, man. Trust and believe. But um, I played up against the dude uh, Sutton again, and I definitely beat him out. Now, um, what I do here is I play five ranked matches a day, and then, oh, thanks for uh, commenting on my video, <laughs> but um, what I do is I play those uh, matches, and then I play five for every server, and then if I'm close to a goal within my achievements, I go ham on one server, so I'll play like 150 to 250 ranked matches a day on one server to uh, get an achievement. And an achievement could be uh, mellow legendary pieces, it could be diamonds, it could be coins, it could be anything. So what I'm doing here is I'm just gonna show you guys I got all my task rewards for today and I haven't even played legendary matches or even coached a position. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna drag this all the way back. You guys see all these players that you could go up against. Now. I can't go up against Hakeem Olajuwon, but check it out, man. We got new stuff on the boards, Inferno. That's Dwayne Wade and Shaq. We also have, yeah, yeah, Golden Duo, which is Melo and AI. Now, this is good because this actually shows you the uh, chemistry that players have together. So if you put Steph and Chris Mullins together, they actually have chemistry. The Unstoppable Force, which is Kobe and Shaq, I have them on this server. And last but not least, you have the dynamic duo in McGrady and Yao. Now, check this out, guys. I'm about to get up out of here. I hope you guys liked this video. I hope it was helpful. And holla at me on every server, man. iPod King Carter. Peace.